Yeah, hello, welcome to Event Tech Studio. Thank you very much for watching my videos online. So in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how you'll be able to use the event tree font or the event font. So if you got this um font, event font or event tree font, the event font is an updated version of the event tree font. So this is how you'll be able to use it. All you need to do is that you need to install if you haven't installed it. So just install. I know most of you have been asking me how to use the phone. So um, this video is um, specially made for you on what characters you need to substitute for getting the other symbols. So you click on install. Because I've installed it already, I'm not going to install it again. So I will not click on replace. I just go by clicking on no, and then I close it. Likewise, you do same for this. So the first version of it was a bench font, and it included only all and the air. But the updated version include um, most of the characters we use in the song lyrics. Okay, so with this one, we use event font. So with the event font, you get all of these characters. So once the font is selected in any application you are using, whether Easy Worship or any other software or even Word document. So I'm going to demonstrate that um, in this video tutorial. So let me start by using Easy Worship. So once you open up Easy Worship 2009, let's try to add some song or lyrics to it. So I give my song a title and then I move to the lyrics page where I'll be able to enter my test over there. So I make sure I select change the font to Aben. I'm going to use Aben font, okay, because I'm going to get all of these characters in there. And the difference between the um, Aben font and then the Aben tree font is the styling. So the updated version has some kind of styling more than the, the other one. So now let's see this. You have to use scale for A. So this is it. These are the substitutions for the various characters. Make sure you select everything in there. And then change the font again because Easy Worship 2009 has that same problem. So, this is how you are going to get it. Now, let me show you how the other one looks like the old one. It looks more like there are a lot of boldness in it, more than this one. And then let's change that particular line to. I just want you to know the difference between the the style format. So let's change to event tree font. You see the difference between the the two fonts, okay? So any of them you are using, and any of them you want to type your song lyrics in, you can do so. Now, for the purpose of this tutorial, I want to use this one. So now let's move to the next line. You use C for all. Let me change the font again. So you use C for all, capital C for capital all. So as you see over here, they are the um, same characters you would be using to get the various um, fonts you are looking for. Then you can see most of the characters. So whatever character you want to get, make sure you have selected the font and then just get um, the characters you are looking for using the font. So let's move on to Easy Worship 7 or 6. I'm going to demonstrate using the demo version. So this is a demo version. So this is a demo version now.
let me change font from Tahoma to Eben font. And I'll select everything. So now I'm good to go. So I'm just using C for the or that is the same thing. So now if you are using other software like Microsoft Word. Change your phone to I'm using the same characters. Okay. I'm using the Q and the A. The reason is that most of these characters are not found in our local symbols. So you can freely use them. And we haven't used numbers because numbers are very important. And then the numbers have been maintained. They will not give you any other character. So you can easily enter your numbers in there. And then use your brackets too as well. Except for some of these characters, which are not really um, used in our local language. So those are, are the ones which has been substituted for the characters we need. So thank you very much for watching this video. Bye.